former Minister of Aviation, Femi Fani Kayade, has reacted to the withdrawal of Obia Zikwesili as the presidential candidate of the Allied Congress Party of Nigeria, ACPN. Fani Kayade said Ezekwesili never stood a chance to win even a polling booth, let alone win a ward or one local government area. In a post on his Facebook, the People's Democratic Party, PDP, chieftain said the former Minister of Education was a spoiler candidate with malevolent errand of mischief. He also called on Kingsley Mogalu to also step down and endorse the PDP's presidential candidate, Atiku Abubakar. Fani Kayade wrote, Obi Ezekwesile has finally opted out of a presidential race in which she had little chance of winning even 1% of the votes. It would have been easier for a pregnant Somalian chimpanzee or a four-eyed Zambian frog to be invited to Buckingham Palace for lunch with the Queen than for this so-called presidential aspirant to win one polling booth, let alone one ward or one local government area, in the race. The fact that Obi's running mate, one Galadima, and her political party endorsed Buhari three hours after she opted out of the race speaks volumes. She, Foladura Toy and Amiyele Sowar were clearly spoiler candidates who were on a malevolent errand of mischief who were never to be taken seriously and whose hearts secretly lay with the tyrant all along. I have no doubt that those who claim that Obi and the other, not too young to run, presidential aspirants, with the possible exception of Kingsley Magalu, were just a front for Buhari and a futile attempt to take votes away from Adiku Abubakar and the PDP. The wisdom of Atiku refusing to participate in a debate with these unconscionable jokers and desperate pretenders cannot be faulted or questioned. They did not deserve the attention that they so desperately sought and their motives for participating in the presidential race are, to say the least, questionable. The only one amongst them that had anything meaningful to say or to offer and that spoke from the heart and with full sincerity of purpose was George Magalu. This is a deeply courageous man that I have come to respect. Nevertheless I urge him to opt out of the race and throw his weight behind a tiku. This is not 